Hi, I'm Tanya Amon, Genetic Service Director for Angus Genetics, Inc., and this is Performance Insights. Today, I would like to discuss with you the dollar value indexes that are reported in Angus Sire evaluations. These indexes were developed with the commercial breeder in mind in order to help simplify the selection procedure by allowing selection for multiple traits while looking at only one number. These dollar indexes take into account outputs that occur on the revenue side of the profit equation, but also take into account the inputs, which means they're rather complicated to develop and to calculate, but to use them is very, very easy because they're reported in dollar values, and higher values are considered more desirable. One dollar index that might be of interest to producers who are marketing their calves at weaning is dollar W, or the weaned calf value. This index takes into account birth weight, weaning weight, milk, as well as mature cow size to give an index that will help predict profit through the pre-weaning phase of production. Let's take a look at an example. Bull A has a dollar W value of 41.68 while bull B has a dollar W value of 2233. What this means is that we expect, on average, calves from bull A should be worth about $19 more per head uh, through the pre-weaning phase. Of course, we know that the costs associated with the inputs as well as uh, feeder calf prices vary, uh, but this should give a good feel for uh, the fact that bull A's progeny are expected to be valued higher uh, through pre-weaning than the progeny from bull B. So, if you're a commercial producer marketing your calves at weaning, I hope you'll consider the dollar W value in your sire selection criteria. For the Angus Report, I'm Tanya Amon.